Hello everyone, my name is Father Felipe Vives. I'm the new associate pastor here at St. Joseph. I was ordained on June 5th of this year and Bishop Byrne assigned me to, the, to this parish and I'm very happy to join all of you in this new journey. Uh, I am originally from Costa Rica. Uh, there's where all my family is. I'm the third of five children. Um, th I'm uh, 31 years old. Um, and the way I came here to Dallas uh, was through uh, the seminary. Uh, I, was, I received my formation at the Redemptorist Matter Seminary, which is the diocesan and missionary seminary of the diocese. And uh, the way my vocation started uh, was through my parents, um, through a, a charism within the church called the Neo Catechumenal Way, um, which is um, a charism which helps people to bring their faith through uh, rediscovery of their baptism. And um, so they, they, they initiated this, they, they began this, um, their own journey, this charism. And after some time, they also invited me to, to enter when I was 14 years old. And this helped me immensely uh, in, a, in a moment of my life in which I was um, very confused, uh, couldn't find meaning in life. Uh, and this helped me a lot to see that, that I was not alone, that, uh, that God is good, that God loved me. And I saw this especially through uh, other people who also uh, showed this love of God to me. So after some time, um, I began to see that God was calling me to the priesthood, uh, especially through uh, the Word of God, and particularly the, this, the life of Abraham, how, he, how God chooses him to uh, enter in, into his plan and uh, to leave all his securities to follow God, to start walking, to follow a promise. Um, that God had made to him, of giving him a land, of giving him a son. And in this, I saw God also calling me uh, to live all my securities, to enter into his plan. So this is how, uh, at 16 years old, I began to attend some vocational meetings um, in which you know, God was helping me to discern whether this was my vocation. Uh, so about two years after that, I, uh, through the help of other people who helped me, uh, to discern priests and catechists, um, I, will, I decided um, to enter the seminary. I accepted this call from the Lord. And um, I, uh, in order for me to continue this uh, way of formation in the New Catechumenal Way, I enter uh, Redemptorist Matter Seminary. The New Catechumenal Way is a fundamental aspect of the formation in the Redemptorist Matter Seminaries. So I attended a retreat in Italy, and in this retreat, um, we came from all parts of the world, um, all those to be sent to seminaries. And at the end of this retreat, they do a, kind of a, a lottery, so in one basket, they put um, the names of all these seminaries around the world. Uh, there are more than 100. And then in, other, in another basket, they put our names. So from the first basket, they drew uh, Redding Tourist Major Seminary of Dallas, and from the other basket, uh, my name Felipe Vives, and this is how I was assigned to come here to Dallas. Uh, I, ha I have been here since um, um, I was 18 years old. Um, so I began this uh, this journey of formation, in which I have seen the faithfulness of God, how God uh, constantly provides in many aspects. Um, you know, coming here as a missionary, I've seen God help me to learn the language to. Um, to finish all my studies, also in the aspect of the family, seeing how um, despite being away from my family, I always see that God provides even in this, giving me many more families, many more friends. Uh, so I'm very grateful to the Lord for this, and um, I'm very excited to uh, join uh, the mission in this parish to accompany Father Jason and to meet all of you uh, and to help in the mission of the Lord. Uh, I would like now to uh, give you my blessing um, and to um, pray that the Lord uh, may help you in all your needs. Let us pray. 
We give you thanks, Heavenly Father, for your love, for your mercy, for the call that you have made to us, to the church. We ask you that you grant us your spirit so that we, we may come to know you and to love you above all things. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen.